Welcome back. This morning we are outside, yes, because why? We're ready to think spring, and who better to have with us to tap into our preppy sides, I actually do have one, than our friend, style expert, lifestyle expert. He knows it all, he does it all. It's Matt Simcoe. How are you, buddy? I feel like experts always a lot to live up to. <laughs> it's a lot to live up to. You always knock it out of the park. Well, thank you. And you know, my inspiration for this seaside coastal style today is the Martha's Vineyard Wine Fest that's coming up next weekend. Awesome. It's in Edgartown. It's one of my most favorite events of the season and everything here you can wear because it's kind of a place to uh, see and be seen if you will. However, before we went on, your life inspiration is... Is, is you, of course, because why wouldn't it sure be? we're on the same page, but yeah. enough about that. If I could let's, be as handsome as you no, someday. No, stop it. Let's get to some of these uh, uh, ideas for looking preppy and sort of easing into summertime. So the whole idea with coastal style is it should be fairly effortless, right? It should be easy. It should be laid back. An item like a linen button-down shirt, right? right? This is from Orvis. It's very lightweight. It's sort of something you can throw throw over on the beach or you can tuck it in with a great pair of pants for dinner and it just it feels very comfortable and, and laid back but still a tight look very nice and I love the well I love one of the footwear options <laughs> <laughs> we each have our favorite on this table right yeah so canvas sneakers are a real classic sort of warm weather look after our feet have been in boots and, and sort of you know slippers all winter long why not put on a really great pair of lightweight canvas sneakers those will go with anything and the best part about sort of this seaside chic is that sneakers are always okay. What are you thinking in terms of socks with these? Low, mid? Because uh, I know I, that the higher socks are kind of back in, which I don't care for. For the, for the kids, Brendan. For the, for the yeah, kids, yeah. I, uh, I would say either a very low no-show sock. They All make right. loafer socks now. Or I would I would just wear them without because I, I really hate socks. <laughs> <laughs> and how about the shades here? So sunglasses, these are Norton Point. I love these guys. They're actually made from sustainable sea plastic. So they take plastic out of the ocean mm -hmm. that has been polluted in there, and then they make them into sunglasses. Right. Um, um, but that's something we always forget on vacation, I mean, is to bring our sunglasses with us. I know I'm wearing them as I'm well. I'm your inspiration, so for the rest of the segment, do my best to look. How cool are you right now? Cool. Here we go. Let's move on to some of these other ideas. All right. So how about um, something that's a little bit on the more ridiculous end, right? So everyone always forgets to bring long sleeves when they travel. Right. But why not make your long sleeve item a blazer? This is Vineyard Vines. It's sort of this Madras style print. But if you really want to kind of stand out <laughs> in a crowd, I like it. This is something that you could do. And, and this is a, a, a blazer to see and be seen in. Right. I've been telling people for years now that I have a yacht. Uh, yes. I don't really. But well, if I did, I'd be wearing that It's like on that it. Friends episode where Joey has the Porsche and oh, the boxes yeah. are underneath <laughs> it. It's, it's the same idea. And moving on down the line. Yeah. So, you know, I want to talk about a pair of white pants. I think everyone, guys, girls, everyone needs a pair of white pants. Sure. Th this is denim. And this will literally go with any of the items that you see here. And you could just put a blue t-shirt on with that, a pair of sneakers, and you're instantly, you know, feeling like, like you're meant to be on the island. Yeah, I think a lot of times we overthink these wardrobe selections, but as you just mentioned, a pair of those handsome slacks, sorry, that's, that's what <laughs> old man Kirby calls Dungarees. With dungarees. <laughs> Yeah, I've been trying to bring that back, but have you? pants yeah. like that with just a simple T-shirt, like everyone will think that you're a, a you know a maven of style, it, and you will be. And that's it. And it's so laid back, and it doesn't have to cost a lot of money either. Right. You can look like a million bucks without spending a million. Absolutely. Bucks. And another pretty color easily. is like a salmon. Down well, there. this is a pretty classic look for for Cape Cod or Newport. They are officially called Nantucket Red Pants. Um, these are also from from Orvis. I think we're calling these Dusty Raspberry. I think that's the <laughs> official uh, name over here. But this is talk about the uniform uh, of the summer uh, anywhere along the coast. Dusty Raspberry. That Dusty was uh, raspberry. my second choice for Instagram handle. Oh, yeah. yeah was that taken? It was taken. Was Let's see taken? how that jacket would look on right. me. I'm not sure. I'm you a 40. You want to try? I'm a 40 long. You know what? This know. is a, it's a 38. Uh, so know. let's see how you can do Either But you've got the Vineyard Vines. You're rocking Thank it today. Thank you very much. Either way, it's going to be <laughs> some DVR worthy. Uh, there you go. Hey, everyone. <laughs> First day of third grade. Is it class picture time yet? This is not a good look for me. It didn't even get over my you know arms. What I've been yeah. working out. Yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'll stick to that. No problem. All right. So this is maybe not the right fit for me, but it's good to be bold and daring when it comes to fashion. And you know right? what? I do want to make a note that it's all about fit. Right. Even if, if the item wasn't tailored for you or the item isn't, I don't know, the most expensive piece, as long as it fits well, Absolutely. it's going to look like a million bucks. Well, on uh, I'll tell you, this is a million dollar segment having you here with us <laughs> every single time. Thank you very much, Matt. Thanks, Always Brandon. A pleasure. Appreciate look at us. That. The sunglass Ready to fight crime duo. Will I see you at the wine fest? Of course. Right. Save me a seat, buy me a ticket, and get me that coat in a 40 long. <laughs> if you'd like to review these great fashion ideas from our friend Matt Simcoe, just head to roadshow.com.